New tonight, the man accused of killing a nurse practitioner in a parking garage at Freighter Hospital was released from jails hours before that attack. Katie Crowther breaks down how that happened. Prosecutors ran out of time to file charges, according to the district attorney's office, which says they were attempting to get Ken Freeman a mental health screening. In most cases, authorities have to charge or release a suspect within 48 hours. Police records show Freeman was arrested the night of the 22nd for resisting and obstructing an officer and use of a weapon. He was held until the afternoon of the 24th. Within 10 hours of release, investigators say Freeman made his way to parking garage number five at Freightert, hid behind a pole, then violently attacked Carly Bowden as she walked to her car. These details coming to light the night before Carly's funeral. Her family trying to focus on Carly's life, not death. It has been very distressing reading the details of, of the incident as well as learning more details about the, the man who did it. You want revenge, but what does that do? And you want anger, but what does that do? Healthcare workers are shaken. Children's Hospital, which is connected to Freighter, sent out an email to employees Friday saying the hospital system will add security personnel for patrols and hire an outside consulting firm to review and strengthen safety. There are more than 500 cameras on site. One of them recorded Carly's attack. Meanwhile, many people are stepping up in the wake of Carly's tragic death. He's going for a choke. I go to the face automatically. MK Protection Strategies offering a free self-defense workshop for all nurses traumatized by what happened. The Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office, which is leading the investigation into Carly's death and which administers the Milwaukee County Jail, will not comment because this is an active investigation. Reporting in Milwaukee, Katie Crowther, today's TMJ4. Katie, thank you very much. And for all the information on the free self-defense workshop, there's a link in this story on our website.